Today we'll be having a look at the Soft Ride Stainless Steel Locking Anti-Rattle Threaded Hitch Pin for 2-inch trailer hitches. Part number SR25219. Here's what the Soft Ride Anti-Rattle Locking Hitch Pin looks like installed. This is going to solve the problems that many have encountered while towing, using bike racks or cargo carriers, of having them rattle around inside your hitch, swaying side to side and causing noise. We'll take it out on our test course and show you the difference between the before and after. Now first we're going to go down our test course without the soft ride anti-rattle hitch pin installed. We're first going to come to some bumps. As we go over the bumps, you can see what it's like driving on rough terrain, hitting potholes, pulling in and out of driveways. You'll notice how much the cargo carrier is moving up and down, causing rattling and banging noises. As we go further down our test course, as we do some invasive maneuvers, you can see how much the cargo carrier is moving side to side and tilting, causing swaying. The swaying also creates noise and makes for an unstable condition for our cargo and the cargo carrier. Now with it installed, as we go over the bumps, you can see how little the cargo carrier is moving up and down. The movement's gone and so is the noise. As we go out further down the test course and hit our evasive maneuvering section, you will also notice that the swaying of the cargo carrier moving side to side is also gone and the contents in our cargo carrier are much more secure and aren't moving around either. Now with just a standard pin and clip securing our cargo carrier here to our vehicle's trailer hitch, you can see how much shake, play, and rattle we have going on with our cargo carrier. This will cause a lot of noise as we're going down the road. And now that we have our locking anti-rattle device installed, take a look at the difference. That shake, play, and rattle that we had before, it's gone. Now what sets this anti-rattle device apart from others on the market is the fact that there is not a spring which goes inside of our accessory to help hold the nut in place. Now, that makes it a lot easier to install this particular locking device compared to the other ones. Now, some of our customers have had concerns about this fitting into their hitch pin hole. Well, it's designed to work with all class three hitch pin holes in class fours and class fives. They all use a 5 8 of an inch diameter hitch pin. It's an industry standard. So if you have a two inch receiver, you don't need to worry about this. This will fit with your hitch pin holes. Now, due to the heavy duty construction of this hitch pin, we don't need to worry about overloading it. Some of our customers have even used this for motorcycle carriers. And with its 10,000 pound capacity, we don't need to worry about it being overloaded in most applications because a 10,000 pound capacity, you're stepping over the limits of most two inch hitches out there. Now, some of our customers have even used this to replace their missing or damaged anti-rattle hitch pin locks that come with their bike racks or cargo carriers. Now this will work with a wide variety of them on the market, but you need to be careful because some manufacturers use different thread pitches that are industry standard. So you'll want to check to make sure that this is compatible with your bike rack or cargo carrier before ordering it as a replacement. If your bike rack or cargo carrier has a 5 8 by 11 thread pitch, this will work as a great replacement and a cheaper alternative than ordering a replacement from whoever made your bike rack or cargo carrier. Now built on to the lock end of our pin, we have this nice dust cover, which is attached via a tether, so we don't have to worry about losing it, and this will help keep the elements outside of our lock mechanism. Now it is recommended once a year to spray some graphite into your lock mechanism so your keys will be able to be inserted smoothly and will turn freely. Our bolt is constructed of a durable stainless steel and our lock is constructed of brass. Both of these materials will be very rust resistant over time. Now that we've gone over some features, we'll go over what's included with the kit. First off, we have our threaded bolt where our lock will go on to. This will help prevent theft and tampering. There's a dust cover over our lock where our two keys that are included will go into. We have our lock washer here to prevent the bolt from backing out. And then we have the mechanism which will go inside of our hitch mounted accessory 
to take away that shake, play, and rattle. Now in our particular application, we'll be installing this on a cargo carrier. Now this anti-rattle device will work with most accessories that have a hollow shank that go into a class three, class four, or class five hitch that is two inches in diameter. The way this works, we take our plastic piece and the rubber piece, we slide the plastic piece into the rubber piece so the grooves line up, and we will drop down our nut here in the middle, and then we'll slide this into the shank of our accessory, and we'll push it in until the nut lines up with our hitch pin hole on our shank. With the anti-rattle mechanism inserted inside the shank of our cargo carrier now, we can insert our cargo carrier into our hitch. We'll line up our hitch pin holes. Now we'll take our bolt and our lock washer and we'll thread it into the anti-rattle mechanism. We'll leave it just finger tight for right now. Now we'll take our lock and we'll push it onto our pin. We'll pull back, make sure it's actually locked on, and it is. And we'll place on the dust cover now to protect our lock. Now we'll take a 7 8 of an inch socket and we'll snug down the bolt. Now we'll torque our bolt to the amount specified in the instructions. And that completes our look at the Soft Ride Stainless Steel Locking Anti-Rattle Threaded Hitch Pin for 2-inch Trailer Hitches, part number SR25219.